taking a live look of downtown Fort Wayne as we're seeing the overcast conditions over the Summit City, but temperatures are much colder, about 37 degree temperature drop for Fort Wayne, Huntington and Defiance. Yesterday morning for Friday, it felt like Florida for us. We reached our high in the morning at 7 a.m. for Friday at 65 degrees. It was warm and humid and now it's cold and dry for us. Looking at the current temperatures, we are into the upper 20s, low 30s, but with that wind chill factor, it feels much colder than that. It feels like into the teens to low 20s, and that's because our winds are coming in from the northeast around 10 to 15 miles an hour for us. Look at our storm track radar. Things are very calm and quiet. Really nothing's going on. We're just seeing overcast conditions to start off our Saturday. Zooming on out, look at the Midwest. Really nothing's going on. Very quiet for Illinois. As we take a look into the Great Plains, still snow showers just north of Omaha. And then look at nationwide. You're starting to see a, a nice little line of showers stretching from D.C. all the way down south to, towards Baton Rouge. These storm systems are pushing off towards the Atlantic, so pretty much is very quiet across the United States. As we take a look at what's going on, there's two things what's going on. So with that cold front, that's gave us some very cold air yesterday, but now we have a high pressure system that's feeding winds coming in from the northeast. So very chilly air today, but then with that high pressure system, it's going to bring some sunshine back towards the Summit City for today. We're going to be very calm and quiet, but then more storm systems will move on in into Sunday night into early Monday morning. And then we'll have a brief dry period for Monday until a second storm system that will move in into Tuesday afternoon. But let's talk about the sunshine returning. So we're going to see a cloudy start to our Saturday morning overcast skies, but clouds will gradually clear out, leaving us a partly cloudy skies this afternoon. Some areas could see more sunshine, just like LaGrange and Warsaw. And then as we get through tonight, expect to see mostly clear skies. So one, I talked about the, how the temperatures dropped and the sunshine returning. So let's talk about the rain chances for the week. Again, really not bad. There's a chance for Sunday night and early Monday morning, but pretty much the rainiest day for the next five days will be Tuesday. And that will be in the afternoon into early Wednesday morning for us. But today it will be chilly, gr clouds gradually clearing out. As we'll be in the low 40s, so if you do want to go for a solo walk, especially with your dog, you might want to have a jacket on, or you can just stay inside, watch some Hallmark. They're actually playing some Christmas movies as well through the quarantine week. As we get through tonight, expect to see mostly clear skies, overnight lows dropping back down to the 20s. As we get through tomorrow, we'll be in the 40s, partly sunny skies, but clouds increasing throughout the day. But then we'll be back into the 60s by Thursday. And we'll be right back.